What's going on guys? Happy Monday. Start of the week. It's about 1030 right now. I'm trying to get some models done for tomorrow for thesis. Uh, finish my mapping. Now, gotta get these models and hopefully get somewhere. So pensive. All right. <laughs> An important tip when making models, the tip of this blade is broken already. After a couple cuts, you should always change out your blade so that your models stay nice and crisp. Just buy a big box of it and go through them all. When would you ever have thought that there would be drones on a fashion runway? Never. This is too funny. It's like a Black Mirror episode. <laughs> Black Mirror. <laughs> Black Mirror. <laughs> have you seen Black Mirror? So the students I TA for today have their very first pinup crib. No, it's like, I have a lot of stuff to bring over, so, and it's like fragile, so I wanted to do it. Tuesday, 10, 12 a.m. It's thesis day. Taking photos of their project. Like hot life. In the middle of a yeah. area. And he <laughs> buys satellite because he's like, he has the means to do it. And so, uh, he, but he's like, yeah, but you know, with satellite, uh, satellite internet, like you only get a certain amount of uh, gigabytes per month. And he's like, yeah, with all these fucking academics sending me a bunch of stupid shit, <laughs> I only get five minutes of personal time a month. <laughs> Everyone like, yeah. No, but I feel like wood is just not fun. Mm. Yeah, what was lecture today also? I was like, oh my goodness. I left. I wasn't there for the last hour. I, left the mm -hmm. I just thought it was like, So really? Whenever I put it out, you guys should go and listen to it. Yeah. What, what, yeah. What's going on, guys? Welcome to Wednesday, my probably busiest day, but yet slowest day because all my classes don't really have much to film. But today, it's gonna be different because it's a certain there's certain circumstances happening. You have the flu? No. Get away. Sometimes your most productive days are the days when you feel like you did nothing at all. In this case, I feel like I've done nothing today. I don't think I've really done much. 
But I feel like I've produced some things. And I've generated some good ideas. I figured out my thesis statement. Uh, got people to critique it, rewrote it, and I think it's in a good spot now. Made it down to like 160 words, something I can hopefully memorize and then present it real quick. Now I have a list of things to work on. <sighs> Continue working on the form and shape of my building, do some drawings, and I think instead of doing a couple images that portray what I'm trying to go for, I think I might do a video, some type of animation. <laughs> no. No, I would break it. This is uh the one that it comes with. <laughs> but this is this is a faster drying ink. The the rapid draw. Yeah. It dries a lot faster. And then I have like the different colors like blue, red. I already have all this stuff. I might as well just like use it. Now. And I just checked the inks, like they're good. <laughs> so like I'm just gonna do it, especially Continue with the spiralness and continuity. Yep. And one of the critiques mentioned during class was that actually, let me bring my original piece. Was that, um, how I mentioned it's interesting to bring like the mix of straight wedges and curved wedges from the sphere, yep. from the um, circle, to create like a spatial illusion. She bought the fan clay's right but that I had been eyeing. What's going on guys? Welcome back. Um, so right now I'm exporting all of my line work. You can kind of see the plans, the elevations, the sections, the perspectives as well. Oh, this is Photoshop. I rendered out a view in perspective and tried to make it as contrast as possible just so that I would get the shadows, you know, try to get as black and white and then some shading here and there to show the curves that are happening in my project. But this is where I want to hear your feedback, guys. What do you do to create a quick representation just to get your idea across? How do you, how do you go about doing that? Uh, is it more in Photoshop? Do you do a lot of line work and editing the line weights and stuff? Um, or do you just render it out, screenshots, and then overlay some, some textures or something to it? I don't know. Let me know. I'd love to hear what you guys do. Um, so yeah, this is just Illustrator. I dropped the line work over the rendered image and I'm just kind of tweaking it a bit, making sure that the line weights work. But guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to leave a thumbs up for sure. Comment, like, subscribe and everything and I see you guys next week.